Christian Verde and today we are going to learn why Genesta drowned on stage while doing the milk can escape in 1930, a escape Harry Houdini invented and was famous for. Both Genesta and Houdini did the milk can escape by getting locked with handcuffs, then taking a deep breath before they went underwater, the lid was put on and locked with six padlocks. The milk can was then covered with a curtain and they made their escapes hidden from the audience to not reveal the secret of how they escaped. We do not know for sure how Houdini did his escape, but Genesta's milk can had a trapdoor lid which was made in a way that he could lift off the top of his milk can, get out and then put the top back on without opening the padlocks. Then he could just wait behind the milk can till he wanted to come out and show that he had escaped. But before the night of the performance where Genesta drowned, Genesta's crew had dropped his milk can and dented it during transport. So when Genesta wanted to push open the lid, he couldn't get out because the lid was jammed stuck. And since the milk can was covered, no one knew he was in trouble before he had drowned and died on stage. Because of this incident, the milk can is regarded one of the most dangerous escapes a magician can perform on stage. In the video you are watching now, you can see me performing my version of the milk can escape. I am not covering it during my escape, so there's no risk that uh, I will drown due to some jammed hidden door. But this is still one of the most uncomfortable escapes I do on stage. The reason I have chosen not to cover the milk can during my escape is not mainly for safety reasons, but during Houdini's time, people were a bit more superstitious and they believed he could melt through the metal and escape that way. Nowadays, if you cover something, people will just think you're cheating and call you a fake. People are actually so suspicious now that even though I am not covering my milk can and can hold my breath much longer, and I do hold my breath for up to eight minutes in my other escapes where I have a see-through water tank or just a glass cube on my head. I have had to limit the time I hold my breath in the milk can escape to four minutes because since people do not see my head during this escape, I have found out that about four minutes is the limit where people will start thinking I'm cheating in some way. I hope you found this video interesting and have a nice day.